Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading. This is gonna be for Libra for your February 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. So uh, we are gonna take a look, look at the person that you're dealing with, thinking of, what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the reads to see what else, uh, what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. Uh, uh, what else? Uh, you may switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective, um... Libra people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. So if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, and my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, uh, the links for those are in the description box below. Um, also, support me on there too. Uh, that would be much appreciated. So, um, tell me about Libra. Oh, sorry, I'm like... <sighs> Tell me about Libra here. The person that Libra is dealing with, thinking of, what is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Libra for February 2024? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Libra, for Libra. We have the Knight of Pentacles here and the Hermit. I don't know. You know, I feel like this person has no bad intentions here towards you, Libra, but I feel like when it comes to you, I feel like this person's just taking their sweet old time getting to know you here. Yeah, this person just wants to move really slow. You know, it's one of those things I feel like this person, like when you have, when you get together with this person, you guys have a good time, you guys have fun, but then this person disappears for a while and then they come back around. I mean, you might find that annoying or something like that because you're looking for something more consistent. You know what I mean? So, you know, I do feel like this person's just trying to take things slow here with you. Um, the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Libra, uh, Virgo energy here uh, with the Hermit, with the Hierophant here, Taurus energy, and the Ten of Swords here. Hmm. Interesting. Here's the thing. Um, I feel like you want to move a little faster than what this person's moving at, the speed that they're at right now. The higher fit here, Taurus energy, because I feel like you're looking for something, you know, you're looking for commitment. And I feel like if you don't, if you, if this person doesn't give you what you're looking for here, I feel like you're just going to end things with this person. Alles gut. So this is like all is good. So I feel like you're not going to try and fight for this or that you're not going to try and chase this person around, you know? So I feel like you're... Yeah, you might be moving on from this person because they're not giving you... Yeah, you're, it seems like you're turning your back on this person. Or that you might feel like because the way that this person is moving, they're not interested in you. I feel like this person is. I feel like this person's on their own pace here, but I feel like this per because they're not on the same pace as you... You know, I just feel like you're, you're losing patience here or that you feel like they're not interested in you. I, I, I feel like they are, but I just feel like they just do things really slowly here. You know, I feel like they're trying to trust their intuition. I feel like they're trying to be methodical about it. I feel like they're trying to get to know you before they dive in head first, which is a reasonable reasonable thing to do. Um, you know, I always say that, you know, f from my own personal experiences, anything that's rushed won't last. Uh, you know, and I, and I feel like that really does hold true because anything that's rushed, it just burns out really quickly. Um, so I, and I feel like this person's trying to do the right thing. I feel I feel like this person comes off as an old soul, or that this person's really, 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 really wise. Okay, the Knight of Pentacles here and the Ten of Yeah, this person wants a relationship here with you, but they just don't want to rush. Yeah, so why not just enjoy the moment here, Libra? You know what I mean? Um, now, it could be the per the person that you're dealing with is rushing and you want to take your pseudo time here. Okay, so the Ten of Cups here. Yeah, this person's definitely looking for marriage and commitment here. This person just wants to take things really slow. Another reason why I feel like you could be rushing is that, you know, uh, I could be reading for the uh, Libra woman out there and, you know, your biological clock is ticking here. You know, that could be why, that could be the reason why there's there's a bit of a mad dash, okay? And um, here's the thing, you just can't force someone to be ready for something that they're not ready for. That's not really fair, you know? So, you know, it's important for you to sort of like, you know, it's either you stick with this person or that you find someone that's also in the mad 
it's all, that's also in the mad dash like you are libra okay so the five of swords and the higher fit near taurus energy Ten of Swords and the King of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini here. Uh, Eight of Cups here and the Strength. Yeah, this person's trying to be very pa patient. I feel like this person's trying not to rush things here. You might feel like this person's playing a game here, but I feel like this person's not. Yeah, Libra, I feel like this person's not. Okay, so the Queen of Swords, uh, King of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the Strength card, Leo energy here, and the High Priestess here, and the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Yeah, I just feel like this person is actually a very balanced, emotionally balanced, a uh, peaceful individual here, emotionally and mentally balanced individual. And they feel like this person just wants to take those their sweet little time uh, so that things don't get burnt out really quickly. They just want to enjoy the moment here with you, okay? What else do we have here for Libra? What else does Libra need to know, look out for, work on for February 2024? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Libra, for Libra. Okay, so we have the Page of Cups here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and the Three of Wands here. I feel, I feel, yeah, I just feel like you just don't want to wait around. You know, I wouldn't be surprised that some of you guys are, you know, sort of like talking to other people or just have other options open just in case here. I, I do feel like the mad dash situation has something to do with like the biological clock here for the woman that I'm reading for here, uh, for the Libra woman that I'm reading for here, the King of Pentacles here and the Six of Wands. I do feel like this person does want long term here with you. Give this person like three years. Yeah, give this person like three years and they feel like this person will be ready. But you just have to be patient here, Libra. Nine of Pentacles here in the Four of Cups. You know, I feel like this is something not to, not to give up too quickly on. But like I said, if you can't go at this pace or that you can't meet this person at their pace here, you know... The best thing that you could do for yourself is, is definitely step away from this uh, because I feel like you're not at the end of the day, if you stay around long enough and you're not getting what you want, you're going to feel resentful. You're going to feel, you know, angry or anger towards this person here. OK, page of cups here and we have the moon cancer Pisces here at the uh, three of wands here in the ace of cups. Believe it or not, this person has strong feelings here towards you. Yeah, I mean, they might not be showing it right now. They might not be, you know, in this like mad dash energy, but this person has strong feelings here towards you. This might completely surprise you here because this person definitely is, like I said, just taking their sweet old time. This person's really happy with you. Okay, this person sees you carrying their child. This person sees growth and expansion here with you. Okay, so I do feel like this person's definitely seeing long term here with you. The Sun card, Leo energy, the Empress, Libra, Taurus energy. We have the Nine of Pentacles here and the Ace of Wands. This person's really passionate about you. This person is really sexually attracted to you. This person has strong feelings here towards you. So, Libra, I feel like you have nothing to worry about here. But like I said, the pace here is an issue. Okay, and I feel like if it if it does be, continues to become an issue here, you know, I do feel like, you know, maybe it's time to step away from this so that you find someone that goes as fast as you. If you guys are worried about the biological clock situation here, you know, I do feel like you guys will still be able to have children, you know, for the women that are still kind of like in the right age bracket. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah. So, Libra, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video. Share this video. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right? Thanks, guys. Bye.